Hey guys, this is Emily Chamberlain here at Airy Farm East. Uh, we we're just getting done. So there you go. Just got done feeding everybody. Uh, we're giving them five buckets of corn, and then we, you can see where we unrolled hay. We unrolled hay every evening. Um, right now we've kind of run into a conundrum where we don't quite have as much pasture as I'd love. Um, we're going into fall, we've had a bit of a drought. There's been no rain since August. So a lot of the fields that we were hoping to stockpile didn't grow back, so our residual is really low. So what we're doing right now is we are increasing our uh, stocking density. So we got them on a smaller area and we're grazing that into the ground. And then in the evening, we supplement the, the sheep and the cows. Uh, give them a little corn for energy. They are in breeding season right now. And then we unroll some hay. Um, the cows seem to enjoy the hay most. Uh, the sheep are kind of eh, about it, but uh, the cows really seem to like it. And then the cows bed down in it. So that also kind of helps spread out our nutrients because they also have access, I'm trying to get it, to those woods up there. So they've been cleaning out some woods as well. We're trying to hold them on that a couple days and make them eat the brush down a little bit better. But uh, it's a beautiful night here. Um, everybody's doing well. I'm gonna turn around so you can see the whole farm and enjoy the view that we get to enjoy because it, uh, it really is amazing. So there it is. Here's our girls. Ugh. This is why I don't ever wanna leave the farm anymore. I get to look at this every day. And some days when they escape, it's a little less exciting, but uh, days like this where they stay where they belong are uh, pretty thrilling. Overall, the, the sheep look good. I'm pretty pretty happy with, uh, with how everybody looks. Although we do have about, you know, 15-ish animals that we can probably pull out of here. We, we do plan to do that as soon as we get them over. That's the gate right there. As soon as we get them back over to there, which might take about another week, we're, uh, we're gonna pull some animals out.